Do you think your attention span is shrinking? Well, you're not alone. The average person's focus nowadays lasts just 47 seconds before they get distracted. And this is particularly concerning for students. But there's recently been a bit of a twist. While the rest of the world spirals into TikTok-fueled chaos, a recent study showed that students using Brainscape have been studying for it longer and longer over the years. So what's their secret? Hi, I'm Andrew with Brainscape, the adaptive flashcard app that uses cognitive science to help help you learn faster and remember for longer. And to find out why Brainscape users' study attention spans appear to be increasing versus the rest of the world, let's start by setting the scene. Researchers have found that our average attention span has dropped from about 150 seconds in 2004 to just 47 seconds today before your brain gets distracted by some shiny object. And this makes sense if you think about it. In the past few decades, our brains have been rotted by TikTok, trained to check our phone for endless notifications, and spoiled by modern movies whose average camera shots switch every two seconds. Honestly, it's amazing that you're even still watching this video all the way up to this point. So what's different about the behavior of Brainscape users versus the rest of the world? Well, according to an intense data mining exercise where we excavated millions of Brainscape users' study sessions for the past 10 years, students have been spending more than 50% as long in the Brainscape app at a time than they were a decade ago. In 2015, the average study session was just over nine minutes. Fast forward to today and it's over 14 minutes per session. Many people would call that a narrative violation. It seems like one of two different things may be happening. A, Brainscape tends to increasingly attract more focused students than we used to at a much greater rate than the rest of the world's attention spans are shrinking, which sounds nice, but I can't really think of anything about our marketing that has changed enough to have such an impact. So it's probably not a sampling bias. It's more likely that it's the second thing. B, Brainscape's user experience has evolved so much that it is motivating users to improve their study habits and stick it out for longer and longer sessions over time. And as someone who has been intimately involved in all the hacks we've been implementing to trick users like you into studying more, I think that's more likely to be the case. So how is this happening? Well, people are just better able to focus when using Brainscape compared to other activities like reading or watching lectures or listening to audiobooks. And there are some reasons for that. First, digital flashcards themselves give you constant feedback on one answer at a time. You immediately see whether you are right or wrong, and you get to immediately rate your confidence on how well you knew each card, which keeps you engaged. Yes, Brainscape has always had those features, but the features have actually gotten smoother over the past decade, which has probably improved user engagement somewhat. Second, between 2018 and 2021, Brainscape began enforcing the 10 card study round in the app instead of just letting people study giant piles of hundreds of flashcards with no end in sight. Just by adding that checkpoint at every minute or three, we made it so much easier for you to say, ah, just one more round, just one more round. And before you knew it, those shorter study rounds actually ended up leading to longer overall sessions studying in the app. Third, we implemented a ton of features over the past couple of years that now make it so much easier for users to visualize their learning progress over time. With all these daily habit goals and a constant carrot in front of your face to keep you pushing forward, it's now so much easier to stay motivated and put in a few more minutes every day. So what can you take away from this? The truth is, attention spans aren't fixed. They're not like your height or your eye color. You can train yourself to focus for longer using tools that work with your brain and not against it. Brainscape is just one tool for accomplishing this when it comes to study, but check out the show notes for some other articles and videos that we've made with hacks to help you improve your focus, your attention span, your concentration, and your overall capacity to learn faster and remember for longer. And don't forget to subscribe also for more great tips, and I look forward to seeing you next time.